What is going on everyone? I hope you were all having a fantastic day. So if you have spent any amount of time here on YouTube or really any other social media platform, then it is very possible that at some point you've heard an influencer talk about the current card. And as someone whose entire channel is about reviewing financial products, it seems only fitting that we finally talk about this very popular financial tool. So today let's open up my brand new current card, break down all of the benefits that it has to offer, including up to 15 points per dollar, which is basically 15% cash back at participating merchants. And most importantly, talk about if this is a good financial tool for you. All right, let's jump right into it. So really quick, before we get into all of the great benefits that the Current Card offers, I do just want to let you know that Current did reach out to me and asked if I would want to take a look at their product and give it an honest review from the perspective of someone who has reviewed and used a lot of different financial products. And I've seen some of the biggest influencers talk about this product, so I knew that I definitely wanted to check it out and learn more about it. However, as always, number one, they made it very clear that they want an honest review, and number two, I will never take on any sponsor for a product that I do not personally see value in for myself or for you as my viewer. So I did just want to give you a heads up on that, but if at any point in today's video you decide that you would like to give this product a shot, then definitely check out the link in the description below where you can get your current card today. But first, let's flash back a few minutes and open up my current card and then go through everything that this product has to offer to see if it is a good fit for you and if it can live up to all of the hype. So your current card is going to arrive in a standard envelope and when you open this up, it simply has a piece of paper inside that says, Welcome to Current. And if you unfold that, right in the middle, we have our brand new, very cool looking current card. And I have to say, as someone who has had a lot of different credit and debit cards, this is a really, really cool design. Don't worry, I'll be getting lots of shots of this card and sprinkle it throughout the entire video, but let's talk about the important part here. What does this card have to offer? And more importantly, is it a good financial tool for you? Well, for starters, in case you have never heard of this product, Current is essentially a fully online or mobile checking account that allows you to take care of all things personal finance right from your smartphone. And the best part is this product is completely free, meaning no minimum balance requirements, no hidden fees, overdraft fees, monthly fees, or or anything like that. Now there is a premium account option and a teen account, which we'll talk about later on in the video. But for now, let's focus on the core features of this product. Obviously, you're able to use your current card anywhere that Visa is accepted. But like I mentioned earlier in the video, you're actually able to get up to 15 points per dollar, which again is basically 15% cash back at participating retail locations. Now the amount that you're able to earn is going to depend on where you were shopping. But the good thing is there's actually a really helpful map right in the current app that shows you exactly where you can earn those points and how many points that store is currently offering. And you can also redeem those points directly for cash that will go right into your current account, which is always an added bonus in my book. You're also able to withdraw cash at over 55,000 free to use ATMs worldwide, and you can even deposit cash at 60,000 stores. And just like the points map that we just talked about, there's also another map that will help you find both the free ATM locations, as well as participating retailers where you're able to deposit cash. There's also some some really good spending insight tools that can show you graphs of your income and spending, break down your spending by category or brand, and even allow you to set up specific budgeting goals for each of those categories. Now, similar to that, they also offer a really cool feature called savings pods, which essentially allows you to automatically have money set aside for specific purchases or goals that you might be trying to reach for your finances in the future. So for example, if I click on the savings pod menu in the app and click on create savings pod at the bottom of the screen, I can specify what goal I am saving for, give it a specific description and photo, and then specify how much money I will need to set aside in order to reach that goal. And from there, Current is going to automatically go to work for me and help me start saving towards those goals using a few different fantastic tools, including automated transfers that you're able to set up, periodically transferring money on your own, as well as round up spending tools that will automatically round up your purchases on your current card and deposit that extra change into this savings pod. So with the basic checking account, you currently get one savings pod. And with the premium checking account, you get three savings pods. So you won't want to create a savings pod for every little thing necessarily. But if you do have some really big financial goals that you are trying to reach, like maybe saving for your next big vacation, or maybe even the down payment on a house, then this can be a fantastic way to automatically start setting money aside for those larger financial goals. Since I mentioned the premium account, let's talk about that really quick, because there are some additional features that you get that I feel make it 
it well worth the investment. Now, just so we're all on the same page, I will tell you right away that the premium checking account is currently $4.99 per month, which if you do the math on that, breaks down to about 16 cents per day. And I'm pretty sure a lot of us spend 30 times that every single day on a cup of overpriced coffee. So I think we can justify 16 cents a day to get a better understanding of our financial wellness. Now, even if you aren't looking to pay $5 per month for the premium account, the nice thing is that they do give you those options, meaning you have the free account that you can always try out and get started with that. And then if you feel like you really like the account and want to get some of those higher end features, then you can always upgrade to the premium checking account option down the road. All right, so 16 cents per day doesn't sound like a lot of money, but what features do you actually get for that small fee? Well, for starters, the feature that seems to be most widely talked about is the ability to get paid up to two days early using direct deposit. So basically, if you usually get paid on Friday, then by using this feature, you will get your money transferred into your account on Wednesday. And if you do decide to use that direct deposit feature with Current, then you will also qualify for Overdrive, which is Current's free overdraft protection tool. And basically with Overdrive, you can actually overdraft your accounts up to $100 and you will not be charged any fees, which that alone could pay for this account for several years, even if you only overdraft a few times. For example, a lot of large national banks charge $35 per overdraft, meaning even if you just overdrafted once, but you have this overdraft protection tool with current, then that basically just paid for seven months of your premium account. And that's not even including all of the other great benefits that you get with the premium account option. So I know five bucks a month might not be for everyone, but again, they give you the choice here to go with either the basic account or the premium account. So if you're kind of on the fence and you're not sure if you like the platform, then you can always give it a shot with the free account and then upgrade down the road if you really like the current card. And while it's not the scope of today's video, I will also mention that, like I said earlier, current does have a teen banking option as well. That is a fantastic tool, not only for teens, but also for parents who might want a way to teach their child how to respond manage their own money. So I could probably make an entire other video just on the teen banking option because this is a really great tool for teenagers and parents. So if that is something that you are interested in and would like to see, then definitely let me know down in the comment section below. As far as the current app is concerned, I have to say I was pleasantly surprised. Again, I had known about current for a little while before opening the account myself, and I think I was expecting it to be really overly simplified. But honestly, it's a fantastic balance of giving you just enough insight and information into your personal finances that allows you to keep track of everything from one app without being overly complex or confusing. All right, so that's a majority of what this product has to offer. So what are my final thoughts on it? And do I think it is a good financial tool for you? Well, overall, I think they're doing a really good job of grabbing a ton of different features that are really popular right now across the board. Oftentimes, these mobile banks only have the capacity to support a certain amount of features for their customers, but Current really has all of the features that you could ask for and then some, plus they are constantly adding new features as well. I mean, you can get paid early, have overdraft protection, free ATMs, free cash deposits, earn cash back on your purchases, spending and budgeting tools, savings pods, plus a few other features that I didn't even mention earlier, such as current pay, which allows you to instantly send or receive money for free, plus their 24-7, 365 day customer support, which is always an added plus in my opinion. Now, I know that some of you might be a little bit bummed out about the $5 per month premium account option in order to get all of these features, but I do just want to reiterate that at least they are giving you the option to have that free account as well as the premium checking account if you want some of those higher end features. And I think that's where a lot of mobile banks fall short because they either fall into that free account option and they might be lacking in a few of those features or they just have the paid account option and people aren't necessarily willing to pay for it without trying out the platform for free first. But with Current, you're really getting the best of both worlds because again, you can try out the basic account, see if you like it, and if you think you would get value out of those premium account features, then you can always upgrade in the future. So overall, I would say that Current is definitely living up to the hype, and I will just mention that the fact that they are so heavily focused on influencer marketing is a great example of how they understand the modern day and changing banking industry and their desire to reach a younger audience. And what that means going forward is they will likely continue to add the most cutting edge features to this product that in many ways are geared towards that younger audience that is looking to better understand their personal finances. So I would love to know what you think of the current card down in the 
comment section below. And remember, if you do wanna give this product a shot, then definitely check out that first link in the description to get your current card today. As always, if you did get value out of this content and you wanna help support me, it would mean a lot to me if you would hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and share this video with someone who you think would get value out of this content as well. And of course, thank you so much for your time. I really do appreciate it so much. Take it easy, and I'll see you in the next one.